what's going on guys today I'm stoked to show you a product that I've been testing out uh, the moonshade portable pop-up awning uh, I have been wanting one of these for a while it's been out for a little bit and I finally got my hands on one the folks over at moon fabrications were really cool and sent me one out to try and show you how it works um, I'm really excited to uh, be using it it's summertime perfect time to have some shade in front of the van when we're out camping yeah it's really versatile I've seen it used not only on vans but on several other rigs so above the cab there's some built-in storage that the Pro Masters have and it just stows away up there perfectly and uh, I'm, I'm really loving it so far so uh, let me show you what it can do figure out is how you're actually going to attach it to your rig um, it comes with a couple different sizes of suction mounts anchors that's what they call them but they also come with these little eyelets that you can fasten into something if you have like a roof deck like me so I'll show you what I did um, but just know that there is probably an option for you so Brittany from Moonshade was cool and had me send her some photos of my roof deck so that she could give me her exact suggestion on how to to mount it for a really quick setup. The whole thing with this thing is uh, fast, portable, and convenient. So the quicker you can set this thing up and tear it down, I think is better. So uh, for me, I wanted that permanent option, and so let me show you what I did. All right, so welcome to the roof, and we have the first eyelet here, the mounting point. I went ahead and drilled a pilot hole and just screwed this in and uh, let's go over to the front and then here's the one that they sent it's a little smaller and it's more of like a screw this was definitely a little little experiment to figure out the spacing but anyway that is what I did all right so I actually found that uh, putting the poles in before you attach it is so much easier and I read that on uh, Barefoot Theory blog as well. So that's what we're doing now. It's funny, it seems like anytime I ever try to put this thing up is when the wind starts to pick up. So uh, you might see some entertainment right now is what I'm trying to say. Let's do it. Here's the uh, built-in carabiners that come in. That's where they click in to your mounting points. All right, there you go. Just like that, clicks in there. What do you think, Sam? All right, this is the point you should be at now. All right, so now we just add the two support poles and uh, you'll see this thing come to life. So we attach these poles to the built-in carabiners here. Now it's time to fasten it down to make sure it doesn't go anywhere. The moonshade came with uh, some guy lines and some stakes that we're gonna fasten this down with, just like this. Get yourself a hammer. Um, I gotta get mine actually. Get yourself a hammer, like so. And there's a little hole to tie a little knot. Then they say to pull it 45 degrees out towards the uh, out away from the van. All right, and in classic Colorado fashion, we got a random big giant cloud and some wind. So uh, the sun is gone, uh, but the moonshade is up. <laughs> if you have any questions, hit me up in the comments down below. What do you think? What do you think about the moonshade? Do you have one? Have you wanted one? Uh, or if not, what kind of awning do you use? Do you think awnings are necessary or not? Uh, for me, I really love this. Uh, I'm excited to have a little patio situation. Uh, it just kind of is that little extension of the home on wheels and it just makes it feel that much more like home. I am going to leave a link in the description box below where you can have a discounted rate, uh, $30 off of the Moonshade if you want to try it out for yourself. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, subscribe for more lifestyle travel videos from myself and Sam. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.